All right, Brother Cyrus, I'm over here at the church. <coughs> All right, so talk about films. My other video's uploading. Uh, but other video, I talk about letting you stick bounce. You know? <laughs> so, doing films, sometimes you let your stick bounce. Sometimes you can count fills, you know, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. <clears throat> you have six teams. The way you count those is one E in a, two E in a, three E in a, four E in a. So one E in a, two E in a, three E in a, four E in a. And that's how you play it. Some people count them. Personally, I don't count them. I just kind of feel it. Uh, Just like that, one E in a, two E in a, three E in a, four E in a. You can count it in your head. Uh, when you play, you can also uh, do a fill. You can also uh, build up to a fill. You can do an extra uh, bass kick. In your mind, you kind of know, okay, we should be ending here. When you hear a song, you kind of know we start here, we end here. So sometimes you listen to the song, you know, okay, when they say this word, that's when we start the bridge or the chorus. And when we say this word, that's when it ends or that's when we halfway. So if you plan by ear, that's when you kind of, you have to learn how to kind of, okay, kind of measure it. So we, if you kind of going off the cuff, you got to be careful with that. So if you know if it's a 4-4, four, four, at least in your mind, you know, okay, it's 1 and 2 and 3 and 4 and, or 1 e and 2 e and 3 e and 4 e and. It's still a 4-4. Four, four. When you start doing 16 notes, you just add more to it. But if you're going to add the <laughs> bounce to it, you just got to know when to cut it off. <clears throat> like me, when I add the bounce to it, but that came with time I mess up with dropping jump sets. I know when to cut it off. But no, sorry, got a got a cold. But also when doing that. If you kind of mess up, you're not sure, you could throw what we call a rest in there, where you just kind of stop for a minute. So it's. You see, it just kind of stop, that kind of hesitation. Boom. That kind of hesitation, that's a rest. That kind of help you gauge where you're at. So that'll help you also. But fills, fills are easy. When you do a fill, if it's a slow song, you saw that just roll it to it. Do 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 boom. Because you see naturally, you see what ends at, and that's what you want. If it's a kind of faster song, you got kind of time it. But you're learning. So when you're doing fills, feel it. That's what I call feel. Feel it. But don't just try not to do a feel just to do a feel. Well, let me just do a flare. Try to do a feel to kind of 
enhance the song or, you know, you feel the energy building, <clears throat> there's easy feels. There's... There's... There's many type of feels. You can look it up on YouTube. There's many type of feels. You just have to find the one that works for you. Slowly work on them. Just... Work around a kit like that. I can sit right here and do all, all these fills for you. But some of the easiest fills you could do. You can go back and watch that. Simple feel like that. It don't have to be in that scrap yet. The more you do feels, the more you feel them. A lot of feels I do, they kind of just have a spur of the moment. The Holy Ghost feels me, and I do that feel, and I'm like, whoa, where did that come from? So the more you do feels, the more you practice at home, the more they'll come to you. Hopefully this helped, bro. If it doesn't help, if you need me to explain it more, like I said, let me know, and I can explain it more to you.